What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Vontae, the first, the day portion of Mugen Eclipse. And it's me, Mr. Twitchy, the night portion of Mugen Eclipse. We are so excited today to enter into the double digits of Season 1 of Undead Unluck, that being Episode 10 today. Last episode, we finally got to, eh, defeat, well, yeah, we defeated um, Victor, well, specifically Fuko. She did her thing. She did? She shot him in the head, reached into his head to get Andy out of there. A lot of great fighting, obviously, from the Union against Victor. They all did a pretty good job. Um, uh, Roman numero one, she, it seems like her power, she can, like, I guess, obtain Copy? or maybe absorb. Yeah, like, something like that. Stuff, because she got burns, um... Uh, power or whatever mm -hmm. on her sword, so that was pretty interesting. Um, we met Top. I, he's definitely unstoppable once again. That's, yes, yeah, one hundred percent. Because he could not stop, but he was doing his thing. He got the drip, going crazy, um, and yeah, I mean, there's not really much else other than us defeating him, uh, Victor, at this moment in time. Relatively straightforward episode last time. We absolutely loved it. Uh, one comment I do want to make is that the union seems very coordinated. They were taking on not only uh, Victor, but all of the copies that he had created. And it was like everyone was saving one another. Everyone was making sure that they were able to take out Victor. So it's like, my goodness, how long or how many times have they had this fight? Because it seems like they're very experienced in terms of taking mm -hmm. him on. So yeah. we know that Andy's at least 200 years old. I'm thinking Victor might be even older than that. But... Mm -hmm. yeah that's all i had to say on the, the previous episode so without any further delay let's get into season one episode 10 of undead unluck right about no what in the head oh, got the crows oh shit we're in brazil yeah. mm -hmm. that's another thing i like too the world building in here we really went to russia we went like to the <laughs> u.s we everywhere oh oh whoa. Oh, he stabbed that boy. Air, a uh, Yuki Kaji. What up, my boy? Yeah, I was like, hold on. The way he talking, that sound very Kaji-ish. <laughs> Favorite voice actor of all time. I'm going to notice within like two. Yep. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's Ooh. going off the grid. Yeah, this is a Fire Force OST. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so she. That thing looks crazy. Right, it does. Uh, Tatiana. Okay, Tatiana and Billy. Billy! Billy! Hi, Billy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so they can create more seats. Mm. Okay. Wow. Is it old boy that we've seen? I would think so. Okay, so they got they did that too. Okay, bunch of mouse. Okay, bro, okay. she was putting Damn. in work. Yeah. What the hell is going on? Whoa, what the hell? Whoa, wow, this wow. is amazing. I yeah. love this quest type of like mini map. Uh huh. Language. Interesting. Okay. Wow. So they Wait. have a red tie for everybody? Yeah. Wow. This world That's is gonna ridiculous. change everything. Now I'm starting Look to make more sense. Look at this. Yeah. Now I'm starting to make more sense of how this works. Like, we're basically creating the world by doing these quests. Oh, my lord. Wow. Oh, my lord. Oh, damn. <laughs> yeah, she's getting it. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> passed. You and me passed? What the hell? <laughs> of course, Jews. Phil! Phil, too. Phil, Phil been getting all them quests, too, though. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> wow. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Andy. Fuko. Shen? <laughs> mm 
Mm-hmm. Okay. Boom. Okay. Now that makes more sense too, because I remember they were saying unrepair while they were talking about spoils, so that makes sense. You complete the quest, you get the location that the reward, the location for the next person. Oh, there you go. Mm. Oh, so that was unrepair is Yuki Kaji. Mm, okay. And we got Stitches Uno Mas. Uno Mas, right? Galaxy, right? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoa. I am okay. scared. That's the spoiler that I got. Remember when I was like, oh, shit, I oh, seen something. <laughs> that, that looks yeah. crazy. I'm like, oh, I seen colors. <laughs> She's not flinching. Mm-mm. Shit. All of them. <laughs> a lot of them aren't flinching. Mm -hmm. They need to make an Undead Unluck game. Please make it happen. Please. Please. It's already there. It's, it's you already in the stars. It. So now you have a galaxy around you? Whoa. Move. Wow. <laughs> the sound design. Aww. Princess Carrie. <laughs> 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 okay so it kind of like rewrites history that is so cool vante do you know about that rock in australia it's like a plateau i've probably seen it before but no i don't, I don't know. It, it's pretty famous it has a lot of uh, mythology around it in terms of being like origin of life or like communication mm. with the stars I'm, I'm not too up to date with it but I, I think I, I've probably seen it before. Yeah. I think the aboriginals are like in mm -hmm. awe of it. It's a little Big Bang. Wow. I that mean, it's ridiculous. making the universe. Yeah. I'm just saying, like, yeah, just the, our universe. But yeah, I mean, yeah. Bruh! <laughs> yeah. Stars in the skies. Well done. So, what, what are people's reactions going to be when they see that? Like, what the fuck? Well, he said that uh, Apocalypse was saying that they erased the memories so that it oh, always yeah, existed. Oh, yeah, right, right. Right, right. But these Damn. guys, they're getting their mind blown. <laughs> it reminds me of underneath... What? Red, uh, green, blue? Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> We could even have space battles on other planets now, theoretically. Because yeah. with Move, if there's no... How the fuck? He just got all this information. Oh, Bro. this is amazing! <laughs> this is a huge world. I was just talking about how huge it was simply by us going to Russia, United States, all these countries. Now we got alien the information. Holy! Wild. Ox. You're an ox. Ox. <laughs> wow. What happens if humanity gets erased? Hmm, I fuck with her! Mm -hmm. I mean, she technically is. <laughs> Cut him up! Not God, the Australian damn. rock! Hey, the sound design about oh. to pop off right now. Oh, she about to take the helmet off. She's Oof. beautiful. Yeah. Negate that justice! Unjustice. Wow, unjustice. What the fuck is? She's numero uno for a reason. Cause we've talked about this. We've seen series where we see justice is basically whoever the victor is. No pun intended. Might is They're right. The ones who is just. So for her to be unjust, is like a rebellion against that. So like, is she like a direct rebellion against God? Uh oh. Hmm. Uh oh. Hmm. Okay. Oh. <laughs> A reset button? Wow. wow. Oh shit. Dude, unrepair just fucked them so much. Mhm. Mm These penalties are almost insurmountable. Here, here we go. I've been waiting on it. <laughs> the final blow. Uh huh. Wow. <laughs> wow. 
Oh my across, God. across space. space. Okay, she is talking crazy. Damn. Hey, yo, mommy. This is mommy. <laughs> bye bye. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, you said, yo, tell them about us. Tell them not fuck to not fuck with Earth. Man. Earth isn't your planet to invade. No, they're gonna have a difference of opinion now of who to add for the eleventh seat. Mm. Between unrepair and uh, unburn. We need to get unrepair because that's Yuki Kaji, man. <laughs> <laughs> That's all I gotta say, man. Sold. Don't burn. You can, you can, you can stay out there. Wow, that damn. This wow. episode was too much. Yeah, too, too much. much. We always say to every, but this one's genuine, like genuinely, way too much, way too much. Here goes the ending. <laughs> oh man, Jesus Christ, this series is interesting. <laughs> I'm gonna Hell. have to sit on this one for about a week until Hell we watch yeah. the next one. Hell yeah. Wow. So Damn. literally, they are rewriting the history books in terms yeah. of they can make anything in the past true so long as a mm. penalty or an Uma influences it so. Right. That's interesting though that like Gina's cared unchanged. Like that power is interesting. Like why would that power because essentially it seems like the god gives us these powers right like pretty much here's an it's idea like a game or a simulation so why so would they give Victor him that thor was saying you act pretty brave for someone with one life who's to say that reincarnation can't be a thing who's to say that resurrecting someone from the dead can't be true we might see gina again hmm true you know something i just realized too the fact that we learned in this episode how like humanity gets their mind erased and their memories yeah. erased and whatnot and we know that like you know this group they don't it's interesting because andy literally has had his mind at the same purposely yeah yeah so this time i'm not gonna no oh, yeah, no, no stop no, it no, no, nope oh yeah let Fuko me look bad there okay. and pause it. <laughs> but yeah that wow because his his whole thing, like his memories too, is like he has that thing that's stored in his mind, like a memory card, essentially. Um, well, or the it's opposite. a blocker, yeah, yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. So, hmm, there is something with him that is definitely, like you said, purposeful in terms of why, like for him specifically, there's something there with him, and it's, it's about his past. And like, I just can't wait till we get to that, man, because. Mm -hmm. That's gonna be real interesting because he seemed, in a way, I, shit, you might be older than 200 years from what they, you know, said. I Maybe. mean, I could see him being like, uh, <laughs> let's just say Adam uh. from Biblical because Andy, Adam, I mean, mm. it's a little bit of a stretch, but I mean, Victor and Vic Thor, apparently they're not the same. So I can see how a few letters could be changed for someone's name over time, either by humanity, right. either by the person themselves, either by them being absent, like Victor was or Victor. Damn, whatever. that's interesting. Because you even said, too, I remember you said it, I think in the last reaction, how Victor, you had a theory that Victor is essentially like the first player yeah. of the game. Hmm. Because, I mean, his power in itself, he literally negated, like, he just negated people's powers. He negated negators. How the hell do you do that? <laughs> but I'm also trying to think, like, with the way that the union is set up, sure, they have 101 potential mm -hmm. consequences or rules that can be added for not completing the quest. Mm -hmm. But they also have a method, at least theoretically, from what we've been told, to where they could level up enough in order to take on the creator or the god of this world right but i don't see how you can level up that much i'm just being completely frank <laughs> with you especially with the introduction True. of uma galaxy like come on unless you just, you just somehow just keep the on universe yeah unless you just somehow keep on accomplishing and completing every single mission but like i don't, I don't know. see it even like, then, what else can man. you even do after that right like what can you 
Huh, this series is going to be interesting because, like, it's, I mean, okay, going back to what I was saying in, the, in the, uh, this episode, to her having her literal uh, negating ability is <laughs> unjust, injustice. Mm. So, like, I I mean, whoever this God is, what what are you, are you just bored? Are you just it's bored? It's got to be, man. Because... Or, like, a computer programmer that made this video game, and he's like, what's the craziest thing I can do? Just... Make it as realistic, quote unquote, as possible to like it being a simulation. And then, hey, right. I want to play in that game. And then mm -hmm. that could either be Andy, that could be Victor, that could be the god of this world. Who knows? Yeah. There's injustice. just so many possibilities. Justice and injustice. That's literally, you're making somebody that's a literal rebellious <laughs> person yeah. against you. Exactly. Like, that's. I, so it makes sense for her to be number one just by design. But that's interesting, though, because, like, Obviously, if we're going by how any series goes, eventually she will probably hit the hay, especially since she told them, like, oh, you got to work your way up to being like me, essentially. So, but yeah. if your direct counter, if you end up, uh, if she dies, the direct counter to the God, it, that's how I look at it. I mean, be an interesting the God thing. writes the rules. He makes the justice of the world. So exactly. that's her having unjustice is an ace up their sleeve. But if they can't ever get to the point where she gets enough experience, she's at the top. So, like, exactly. there's nowhere but down <laughs> to go for her. She still has not gained huh, enough experience. You know experience. something else, though? She doesn't even have an assistant, from what we know, right? Uh, I mean, I know she doesn't Probably not in one, the traditional like, sense, like Shen, yeah. but, I mean, uh -huh. I don't know. But maybe that's the thing, too. Like, maybe we do need, like, an Andy and Fugo to get up there. Maybe it's not... Mm -hmm. uh it's more complicated than or maybe she you know what though ah i mean the fact that we keep going on and on about andy and potentially her like that's his, that was his wife or something there maybe maybe she did have a partner maybe he was her partner at one point in time and then she did that maybe victor was a part i don't know like oh she it, Okay. Because she had to have one, maybe. Oh, well, we just don't know how the construction of the union was years ago. We don't know how old she is. I'd assume that she's pretty damn old. Like, Do you remember that old. thought I had about like what this world would have looked like without dead or death? Mm -hmm. Like, maybe her partner, quote-unquote, uh... lost all of his HP in the game and then just <laughs> collapsed. So, like, the body right. is still there, but maybe not, like, the actual person inside because death wasn't a concept. And then right. when Andy got introduced or the rule got introduced, then it's like, oh, okay, well, maybe this person is now alive because they didn't die when Ooh. death was a thing. Damn, what the fuck would have happened to him to get his HP to zero then if there was no death? Like, what did he do? What was he doing? I don't Who's know, man. I, I don't have the answer to that question. Damn, man. Absolutely Andy, not. <laughs> that makes sense. Though. Even his literal design of his character, like, he looks he looks messed up. So that, honestly, that theory sounds about right. Like, he got fucked up so bad. Mm -hmm. He was basically just a husk of a being. Not Jesus. necessarily dead, but essentially dead. And then yeah. that rule came into play. That's interesting. But, uh, yeah. I'm, I'm going to end the discussion here, though. I don't want to make it too long. <laughs> it's hard. That's okay. Yeah, I got something to go after this. <laughs> but my God, what an incredible episode of so many theory crafting uh, revelations that were revealed. Yep. I, I don't know what to say. Fantastic. Well done, Undead Unluck. Well done. <laughs> yes, sir. You guys know the drill, man. Pull up every week. We got a whole bunch of content out. We give you guys community posts to keep you guys updated as well. So pull up every week. Uh, especially in this month we got a lot of stuff coming out towards the end of the month to the beginning of next year so with that being said i hope you guys all have a good one so please stay safe stay healthy stay clean see you guys on the next video and peace peace